Hello, Preaching Forward. This is Matthew Barnett of the Los Angeles Dream Center. And Sam Duth is a great friend of mine, and he asked me to put this video together to talk about one thing that maybe I could share with young preachers that would help them in ministry. I started pastoring at 20 years of age, and I uh, learned a lot through failure. I learned a lot by making mistakes. I learned a lot by trying to be the perfect preacher when God was really looking for some other things in my life. And one of the things I learned in ministry is not only do you need to prepare your content, not only do you need to prepare what you're going to talk about, but you also need to prepare your heart. More than anything else in preaching, the most important thing is to preach with a broken heart. What do I mean by that? What I mean is think about the people that you're about to serve when you drive in the car on the way to church on Sunday morning. Think about the husbands and wives that maybe even had a fight before they even got there and, and uh, they're even going through issues in their own life while they're sitting there in the pews. Think about the brokenness and the hurt and the pain. And one thing I've learned is that people oftentimes can't retain a lot of information. But give people one great thought. One great thing that God is maybe dealing with you as a pastor during the week or things that you're learning or growing through. And sometimes your own experience could be that one great thought. Sometimes what you're dealing with and struggling with is one of the most important things you can share with people. Sometimes uh, people say to preachers that preachers shouldn't always preach something unless they're living it. I don't necessarily agree with that. I think many times preachers need to preach even their own struggle they're going through. The thing that they haven't perfected, that they're dealing with in their own life in order to relate to people that would realize that he's going through that, maybe I can go through that too at the same time. But find yourself one great point, one great thought, one great theme. You know, carry it around a cell phone with you and, and if something touches your heart, speak into it and record it and remember that illustration that takes place because things are happening all week long in the life of a minister. And if you document those things, record those things, they could be things that could be funny, they could be things that uh, you've done wrong or things you've done right or whatever. Experiences of life to bring into it. And what I would encourage you is not only to work on delivering your message the best you possibly can, but I would say for every time you do that, five times more you need to work on your heart, having your heart prepared. Don't preach necessarily with, a, with only a prepared mind, preach with a broken heart. And when you do that, you'll be able to relate to the people because it's not always what you say that matters the most. Sometimes it's the sincerity that's coming from your heart. So I encourage every preacher not to try to preach a good sermon on Sunday morning. Just try to be broken on the inside to share what you're going through and be vulnerable and open about your experiences and the victories and the trials and put it together into one great theme that people can get. Circle around that theme a little bit. Uh, make sure people get that then when they're walking out of the building. Uh, whatever your message is, if it's I can do all things, they leave and really believing that the one thing will guide them during the week. I can do all things or whatever your topic is, make sure that you leave them with that one great thing that they can take home with them to move forward for the glory of God. So I guess my advice would be um, preach that one great thing that God is dealing with in your life. Write down those experiences, record those experiences that are taking place in your, in, 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 throughout the course of a week and allow your heart to be broken. Think about the people you're going to minister to before you even get there. And when you do, you'll get up there and preach with the kind of heart that God wants us to have. And that's a prepared heart, not only prepared mind, but go in there with a prepared heart, ready to share what God has given you. I love you. You're going to do great. It took me 10 years to learn that. I know you're going to get it in the first month. Congratulations on moving forward and all that God has called you to do. Exciting times are yet to come. <music>